Duke, Wakanda, Scarlet, Cobra, and Metalhead. Look, here you go, baby. All these buckies. Roman Reigns and whoever that guy in the right is. I think his brother's going to get, I don't want to say killed, just throwing it out there. Let's go ahead and leave it for the next guy. Oi, Chico. Peace. Spider. Spider shot. Good with names. I'm bad with a memory. Tombstone. 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 Dang. Okay, keep going. Oh, wow, you got a street fighter. Dog. You found him, remember? Yeah. You found that you found him at Target? Yeah. You this, got this one is for you. Yeah, thank you. Yeah. Thank you for getting this for me. Yes. <laughs> Archer Bunny. Archer Bunny. Let's try Archer Bunny again. Archer, is that your Archer Bunny? Yes. What are we watching? That's right. Look at this. Look at that dog. That's that's a cow. Oh, my bad. Skidoo. Skidoo. Good Friday morning, muchachos, bad gangster, Mimi goes, all you ninjas of nostalgia, you you toy hunters, toy enthusiasts, you 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 animals, just crazy animals out there. And the non-bots too. <laughs> Good morning guys, welcome back to JB's Toy Truck for a Friday morning toy hunt. This is gonna be part one. Everybody's sleeping in the house. Uh, my son's got a couple couple more days of vacation. I said, sleep in. Dad's going out to go look for toys. Granddaughter, K-Bop, she's sleeping. Marsha's sleeping. I can't sleep. You guys know that. Like to burn gas, burn the fuel, bin, burn the petrol, that rocket fuel. Going to go look for some plastic. First stop is going to be a Walmart, then a Walmart. And then a Target, because by the time we get to that Target, they should be open. Oh, you guys looking for the time check? Oh, 710. I did sleep in a little bit. Oh, 710. Getting ready to go out. Uh, you can see the sun's bright in my eyes, waking me up. And your weather check for this morning, 44 degrees. It's going to warm up. It's going to be a nice day. 44 degrees. And headed out on this awesome toy hunt. If you're new to the channel, welcome. If you like the video, like, comment, share. And if you do like the channel and you like the content, hit that subscribe button with that bell for notifications so you know the next time we're gonna be dropping these goofy shenanigans and toy hunts and awesome. We do fun things here, guys, on the channel. And a lot of it is because of you and the community. Shout out to everyone at Toyland. I'm talking everyone from Ricky and the staff on down and up you guys are tremendous and amazing we can I'm, I'm already looking forward to next year give me the date when are we doing it come on i gotta plan this stuff out we'll see you guys at walmart there it is got the walmart got some music going got some got some music got some b-boy music going on let's not let's go into the entrance let's be let's do this the right way well got barbie but you know granddaughter likes Transformers, no, no snarl. Some of you guys hit me up saying, find that snarl. I haven't, because <laughs> I know Swoop's coming around. And some older Marvel Legends. No new Spider-Man wave. There's the Egghead. <laughs> Infinity Saga set up. I'm gonna run through a lot of this, guys, because it's gonna be a big toy hunting day. So I just wanna kinda highlight and spotlight some of the things that we haven't seen. I mean, you guys have seen a lot of the videos where we've seen a lot of this stuff hanging. And I don't want to make it too long of a video. Wrestling over here. Okay, yeah. So, peg warmer of the year. CM Punk. One, two, three, four. And uh, mark down one probably because I'm missing. Yep. No, I don't know. Damage box. So, you're looking for a discount because he's nothing but a discount to me. CM Punk. I know, I know our buddy Seth likes CM Punk, and that's all good. I don't. <laughs> there's Alexa. There's Taker. 
And there's Roman, tribal chief recognized. So we saw him at BurgerFi. If you guys look back at the uh, Tony Lana video, unfortunately, we didn't do creep shot and you know, we take a picture of this guy. He, I mean, his face did. Um, I think, I mean, he's a big dude, but I still think I was taller than him. So, uh, anyways, we saw Roman Reigns at the Burger Fi getting a, probably a double bacon cheeseburger, extra chocolate milkshake, whatever. Um, Alexa, Roman, Alexa, Alexa. Okay. Well, I think that's really the only newest things here. Okay. There's a Bowser. I'm going to scan to Luigi, see if he's got, gone down past 12.50. And I think there was some stuff down here. Yeah. Star Wars. Hey, look. Family. Jan. Family. Forgot to check the uh, collectibles area. Let's see what they got. Some turtles. Dragon Ball Z. Man, I got a ton of these. There's the Invisible Man. That Splinter. Foot Soldier. The new, there's my cousin, Reyes, foot soldier. And they got a ton of them. Of the uh, Team NT3 wave that was released. See, uh, Splinter is another foot soldier. So the new Eastman and Layer target stuff is hitting. So that's one big reason why we're going to try to hit a couple targets today. So, all right, guys, let's get out of here. Oh, there you go, Ryan. There it is. All I got is Hogan's. <laughs> I'll dig through it. I'm going to send you a picture right now. Poking around. Look at this. JBL. <laughs> Kevin Nash. Rock. What do we got in there? Got good times. Some Clarence Destro. Ooh. I'm going to ring him up see what he comes up at. Clarence Destro, look at that, Super 7, Ultimate, Yellow Ranger, no, that's not the price, we got in here some Kurtz, yeah, oh yeah, we were here the other day, it's just Kurtz, Bobby's, Bianca Wave, oh, there's an Alexa in there, so, no Roddy Pipers, no Roddy Pipers, look at that, loaded, stacked, and we looked through here already, but just to show you guys, X-Wing, B-Wing, and the Special Forces TIE Fighter back there. No translucent blue X-Wing. Man. Um, they got the Ahsoka. I think that's the first time seeing that. But, oh, look at that. I think I might get a trooper just to see what they're like. It's quite a few of them. I know a lot of you guys are looking for them. I'll scan these, see what they come up with. But other than that, nothing different, guys. Headed to Target. So I guess these are the, the newest um, of the Star Wars basics. There's a Luke, Jedi Luke. <clears throat> Sorry, guys, I'm still a little sick. And then there's a Grogu, and then the Ahsoka. But, yeah. Stormtroopers ringing up at 9-something. So... I don't need it, but it look good as an army builder, that's for sure. Man, it's 8.01, and I already saw a guy that looked like a collector going to the Target. I'm late. He's got all the chases. He's got all the new G.I. Joe. He's got all the new Spider-Man wave. He's got, I bet you, M. Bison and Dawson. I just know it. He's probably also got the new NECA TMNT that's hitting. I don't even know what's hitting, guys. I know Dave was looking for a lot of it. If you're not following the brightest of the diamonds, Diamond Dave, you better. Because if you don't, you're wrong. But yeah, looking for some TMNT while we're in Toy Lana. Uh, everybody else is getting it except for, obviously, when you want it the most. So we'll see if they have that too. Let's go in here. I don't need that hat though. Yep. Collector on the hunt. Cart, shopping cart. Guarantee it's Hot Wheels. Not judging. Not being prejudiced, prejudging. But I am. <laughs> yep. 802 now. Let's go see what they got. 
I was right. I was right. I was right. No new GI jokes. Who's that? Mutton junkyard. There's a bizarro Batman and Superman. Some beefy Superman. Look at this. Flashback. Justice League. Batman. Batfleck. Black Manta. Aquaman. No new Transformers. We got Peter. That's it for the Infinity. Oh, new. New, new, new. New, new, new. Look at that one. Is that Mark LXXXXV? <laughs> Don't like the arc reactor where it's just painted white. Come on. They could have used a translucent on there. Cool. Don't need it. I would love to. If I know if it goes clearance, I'm getting it for the Hall of Armor, but we'll leave them up there. Oh, oh look. Guess we missed the chase. Yep, Darby's. Well, so I don't have a horrible mustache. There's two of them. And I know there's a deal going on. Marshall would kill me. Oh, there's the new Darth Vader. From New Hope. That's cool to see. So we got Ted Bane and okay, the Mando. Soft goods? No soft goods. Pass. I think the book of Boba Fett has the soft goods one, which I, I missed out on. And that one I would get because of the soft goods. So. I already looked through there. No, did I? Yeah, the other day. Yeah, no chases. Donnie, Jitsu, Stratos, Mouse Jaw, Old TMNT. I think it's time to go look at NECA. Hey guys, here's their uh, NECA collectible. NECA Funko collectible area. They still have Lando, so we're good to go. The scene is safe. We have a cape. We got a, there you go. Sounds like me. Got Liu Kang's, or it's not Liu Kang's, but Fei Long's. And we got Ken. Um, like I said, the guy he threw me with that sneak, that blow of his nose. Hey, right, we got some uh, mystery boxes here, which we're good on. And oh my God. All right, we were here just the other day, guys, and I skipped on them, but uh, I hate it. Uh, we saw him last time, and I skipped. We're not skipping today. They got the coupon, and I used my red card, so we're going to get the three of these guys. Dang it. Just to take them off card. Sacrilege. Come here, little little Godzillas. Uh, got some McFarlane up there, non-chase style. Got some Pops. Got some NECA. So we have that guy. And I think that's it. We'll dig through. Got that. All right, guys, it's time to roll out. I don't see anything new. We got to get to the other stores. All right, one that I did gloss over Bert, Ernie, Yip Yips, and the Count. You guys just laugh at me. Put it right at this point. Go ahead and timestamp it. Leave a leave an either an emoji or an LOL or ROFL with uh, JB and his issue with Super 7 Reaction. <sighs> okay, well I didn't see this, well, I was up there and I just looked. It is Casey Jones. Battle damage, that's bad, you know what. Huh, best action, that looks good. I don't know, looks good to me. While I'm looking, look at the slash. And then there's the crane. So, best action. But damn, that looks good. Is that a chase? Limited edition collector card inside. So, pretty cool looking. This right here, this uh, the steel core. That's pretty cool. They got like jet packs. And you could army build those. And then there's the general. Hulk. Some dreadnoughts. 
rock and roll. You don't see this Viper too often. But that's not what I saw. Oh, look at this. Batman. Two-Face. Batman. What do you think of this? What do you think of this head sculpt? Christian Bale. Not bad, huh? Not bad. Not bad. This is what I saw. Look at this. <laughs> they had him at the convention, but I missed it. I saw it on someone's video. <sighs> Hope I have my coupon. Dude, tuxes. That's awesome. Hmm. Mac. Hey guys, happy Easter. And yes, unfortunately, it's our travel day back to South Carolina. And where else do you stop when you're halfway through Bucky's? Let's see what they got. I need you to go that way. <laughs> got it? Marsha's driving. Sirius XM. Bugs and Bugs. And we got our forerunner. That's that is how you do it through Atlanta. Go through the spaghetti. Welcome home. Home sweet home. This ain't my home. Or I don't even know where we're at. Are we somewhere in Georgia? I think we're in Georgia. <laughs> See look, this doesn't have the soft goods. See, no soft goods. It's it's dumb. That's a good one. Well, so that's a good one. These are good ones that we I skipped on. Still might go back in. Here's that Darth Vader from A New Hope. All right, so promise, some promise. Oh, what'd you find? They I had them. Yeah, I know they did. I like that. Had different head sculpts there. Ah, it's for like Halloween. Look at that. Right, I told you it's promise right off the bat. Uh oh, you find? No start digging while you're doing that looking for nope 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 some Lando's hey we got Lando in the house if you're looking for him we got one two three four five six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve you got a dozen Colt 45s blue boots. oh and a blue boots <laughs> I, I know someone who needs this Really? Yeah. Oh no, that's not the blue boots. This is the this is the wave we're looking for with Doink and oh. Andre. Remember, and this is like the that 70s style. But you're right, it is blue boots, so <laughs> you are correct. But the wrong blue boots, Hogan. Well good call. It's still good to see. We don't see it too often. I mean we don't have it in our area, that's for sure. Except for that one in Monk's Corner. Hot rod. Shout out to Oleg for finding the ultimate hot rod. Look at that Jake the snake. Oh, right in front of us. Look. Take her. Oh, Stone Cold. See, look. Look. Stone Cold. Hogan. Another Hogan. And Oye Chico. So they got all four. See, we have to travel out of state. That's what our buddy Ryan keeps talking about. We got to travel out of state to find... Well, to find what, what he's really looking for. I'm I'm trying to help. Because I'm probably not picking up anything from that wave. But I'm going to pull this aside. Take a picture. You see any ultimates down there? No. What do we got here? Bulldog. Shawn Michaels. Some Fortnite. Yep. I don't know. Seriously considering it because of those head sculpts. That looks so cool. <laughs> we'll play a little long game on it, you know. It looks pretty cool. It's the slowest door ever. <laughs> <laughs> Buenos dias muchachos, welcome back to JB's Toy Tournament for this week's hunt and huge, dynamic, dynamic. <laughs> haul video. This is uh, part two of our spring break toy hunt vlog vacation whatever you want to say uh the first video is actually should be 
dropping today, which is April Fool's Day. April Fool's Day. And um, yeah, and it's just a hunt. And of course, a little bit of thank you in there. So if you haven't seen it, go ahead and click up here and check that out because a lot of the stuff that we found in there is the majority of the haul, which you will see at the end of this video. So yeah, it is uh, about that time. It is early. We're going to go out and hit a couple Walmarts and maybe one Target and then come back and recap and do the haul. So uh, again, you uh, guys are tremendous. We hit 3000. Thank you so much. Uh, if you're new to the channel, consider subscribing, but definitely if you like the video, like, comment, share, subscribe, definitely helps get the video out there. Not just my video, but all the videos out on YouTube, whether it's a toy channel, uh, whatever DIYs, whatever it is. If you really like the content, make sure you hit that like button, leave your comments on uh, all creators, all creators uh, truly appreciate that. I appreciate, I can't speak for all, everybody guys, you know how that is, but yeah, uh, we're in the room. So uh, it's getting super crowded. We're still rearranging a lot of stuff up there. And um, yeah, I got rid of a lot of black series. I definitely love my setup with the uh, McFarland 66 stuff. I might be moving it again, but it's just there temporarily, you know, the, the shift and move, shift and move. And then of course, McFarland going in, going heavy back to McFarland because of Batman. And if you guys watch WonderCon, there's a ton of stuff out there that um, I will be pre-ordering sooner than later. So um, it's, it's really gonna get crowded in here. And um, I don't know what else to say, except thanks for watching. And uh, thanks for watching. If you haven't yet, the Toyland video, let me go back. Yeah, Toylanta video. We picked up some stuff that's going to be at the end of this video as far as the haul. Toylanta, the April Fool's Day drop video, uh, part one. And then, of course, this video, which is the part two of our couple week vacation and fun time. So thanks again for joining us. And uh, we'll see you. It's going to be Walmart. So we'll see you at the Walmart. See you there. It's already 6.02. I'm late. <sighs> go to the back and work our way. Man. You're telling me it's been over a week and nothing? Nothing? Nothing except for the same? Dr. Thunderosa? What? Hunter? <laughs> blue boots, but not the blue boots we're looking for. If you guys saw that. Uh, rock and roll. Little rock and roll this morning at the uh, Monk's Corner Walmart with really nothing. It's almost like it is rock and roll, but it's dead air. Some older Zelda and Mario figures. There's Poppy over there. No, no, not even Pokemon. I'm swinging back to the uh, Micro Galaxy Squadrons. Ezra, Four Stomachs, Little Chop Chop, Lando Colt 45 holding it down. Rest in peace, Lando. Uh, not Lando, Apollo. Jeez. Some chrysanthemum. Jiminy Christmas. Oh, that's cool. And Vampire Robin. Well, they are moving a lot of stuff, so I'm going to dig around and see if they've shuffled. You know, the shuffle, shuffling of the deck. And here's some older Marvel Legends. Wasp Wasp. Egghead back there, another egghead. There's nothing like having two eggheads. Old Spider-Man wave. I just backed into this thing. It's in my way. Turtle Mayhem, Godzilla, and no Dinobots. All right, well, that was a quick one. Let's go, I'm gonna poke around over there. Take to the collection area, really nothing. Some NECA, some good NECA. Predator, Gremlins. Got the, um, is it Donnie and Leo movie two pack? You see two of them down there. So, he's been a Laird's Alf and some Spawn, Laird, old Spawn, some more Beast, what's that? Beast Kingdom, best action turtles hanging around. You got Hooper, not in his scuba outfit. And you got Foot Soldiers, TMNT from the third movie, Funko. Got some. Super 7, just hanging out, ready to get damaged, and some older pops. Yeah, time to roll, guys. Let's see if we can find something inspiring on this April Fool's Day. That's not an April Fool's joke. That really happened. We went to Monk's Corner and Goose Creek. I didn't film Goose Creek because there was nothing there except the Hot Wheel guy. 
and uh, I'll talk about that here in a little bit. Stopping by Somerville Walmart before we go to the Target just across the street. And that should be it for this video. We got a huge haul, so make sure you stick around for that. Well, they're busy at Somerville Walmart, but really nothing going on. Uh, some basics. We got Seamus. Already picked through that stuff. Ryan was just here. Um, some of this, I found a Sabine Wren, which I think Art G needs. Got some Mando, another Sabine Wren. Chop, 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 chop. The Soka Wave just hanging out. Hanging out. And then some TVC that we've seen before. There's Nib Nub and Weequay that I still need. Look for the chases on the micro, nothing. And this looks like it was just put out. Okay. Platinum Edition. Jim Gordon. I've seen him a couple times. We'll put him up front for a little boy to get. Or girl. <laughs> That's cool. Alright, well. Platinum Edition style. Marvel. Older Marvel Infinity Saga. Yeah. Tony Stank. Cap. Um, Thor. War Machine. Dr. Banner and some Mutant Mayhem turtles and that's about it. So, all right guys, let's go to Target. Well, I could already tell. Well, we got Deadpools. Is this new? I think it is. I don't have a Deadpool. What? I might get this. Martian doesn't know, but I'm probably gonna grab that because we don't have this. We got a good run of that, so we'll see. Um, the Marvel Blacklight Pops. This the few pops that we do get. So they look like they're at, they're off kilter. Sopranos line. It's off kilter. So we'll grab that. And I notice these up here. They're all firestorms, guys. And then the Abyss. So I don't know if they found them in the back. And there's a Batman Wave Rider. Oh, the Holothons finally here. Holothons here. Holothon. Holothon made it to our <laughs> April Fools. Wrestling, still the same. Still have Thunder Lips, Sheik, Trish, uh, nothing with Star Wars. And He Man, Turtles of Grey School, Man at Arms, He Man, uh, Mouse Straw, nothing on the Star Wars Galaxy side. Turtles is the same, Jurassic Park is the same. That's the same. How inconvenient. NECA. You got the Fiend, Jigsaw, Vira, Gremlins, some Team and Team Monsters. Looks like they, oh, they almost got the whole run of them. You got some Predator, some uh, Prince Voltan, T2 back there, Conjuring. No new neck, no new NECA turtles from the Holothon. So I wonder why he's the greatest. Oh look at this. There you go for your inbox, guys. It's wet. Let's see if the figure, the figure's still good. Oh, no way, it's missing. No. I don't know, it's like all, all oh, it's oil. Oh. It's not good. Oh my God. It's got oil on it. Ugh. Guys, welcome back for the what's in the trunk portion of this video. It is a hunt and haul. I'm talking dynamic haul. It's been a whirlwind of fun over the past couple weeks. And again, thank you guys for always tuning in every single week to watch. We try to get two videos, at least one or two videos out a week of all our shenanigans. And of course, rebuilding or building a collection that, you know, we haven't had really ever in the past couple decades, uh, along with me, my wife, uh, my sons and my granddaughter and, you know, our extended families. It's, it's been a ride and that we've been enjoying it. You know how I always sign off, we'll always enjoy the ride, but, um, uh, we've took a little bit of a vacation, you know, it's time to get back to work. Today is uh, really my last day off for the next couple weeks. So it's, it's going to be fun. It's going to be interesting. I'm going to have to I'm going to have to, sh you know, I got some stubble now, so I'm going to have to shave all this and, you know, get all nice and into, into work clothes and, and do the thing, you know, work that nine to five or, you know, four to f four to 12, it seems like sometimes with only a couple hours of sleep. So, 
Um, not complaining by any means, but you know, it is what it is. This is the fun stuff. So thanks for coming in. Thanks for all the fun. Remember, if you like the video, don't forget to like, comment, share, subscribe. You guys are tremendous. So without any further ado, let's go ahead and get into this haul. This haul is really comprised of Toylanta and our trip to see our family while we were there with the granddaughter and of course on our way back and a little bit of today. And like I was saying earlier, today's April Fool's. April Fool's Day. Stop. April Fool's, you know, things like that. There's really nothing that I could think of for April Fool's Day. Um, but uh, the other day, I was actually thinking of a few things as April Fool's jokes. And again, I didn't know if I was going to get to this mark. So check this out. Another one. Thank you. 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 Last but not least, I want to thank me. Ah, you can feel it, dude. You can feel it. Load the spaceship with the rocket fuel. Load it with the words. Ah. You love me. You really love me. Sorry about that earlier. I forgot to put my hat on. I was glistening on that bald head of mine. But yeah, guys, that was just joking around. 3,000. I know you really, you really do not love me, but you love, we love you. Let's just turn that around. We love you and everything. We thank you. Not Snoop Dogg where I thank me. I thank you. Um, April Fool's, that's not how we are. You know it. I mean, me and my wife, we truly thankful every single day. So let's stop talking. I did find a few things today. Here's the holothon that we found today. <laughs> Just kidding. We found the bag from a couple years ago. I was it two or three years ago now. That Holothon bag hasn't hit our area. I think it hit West Ashley. I wasn't able to get there this morning. So uh, it'll pop up. And again, I'm not really looking for too much out of it. So regardless. But I did find one thing that we did pick up on April Fool's Day. And this is no April Fool's joke. We picked up a black light Deadpool. That's going to go, um, if you saw in the thumbnail, we got the X-Men or the Marvel and MCU X-Men, whatever you want to say. Marvel black light pops. We got almost the run on them. So we're just going to continue with it. Um, I think they look cool. The black lights and of course how we have them set up. So one fun, one Funko pop every three months. I'm not going to say it's bad. It's horrible, but it is what it is. Something my son found uh, while we were gone. Our oldest, he found this uh, the other day. It's the Fiat uh, treasure hunt. So pretty cool for him to find. And before we get to more of the actual haul from our trip, I, I want to open this up from our boy, um, uh, Comics, Comics 1017. He uh, hit me up and he said, JB, you got this. And I was like, no. And, I'm, you know, we're reluctant not so much to get gifts from you guys. It's just we kind of try to find it on our own. It's kind of fun that way. But, you know, I'm not saying when times get tough, tough, you know, when times get tough, the tough get going. Name the movie. Name the movie. Great movie, by the way. So let's see what we got in the mail. This is what something we've been hunting for a couple couple months now. And uh, thanks, man. Appreciate you. Good packing, too. Hit up uh, Comics1017 on Instagram and on YouTube as well. Look at that. Doink the Clown. And great find, great card. But I'm telling you, brother, he's coming off. Oh my God, I cannot believe I have this in hand. Doink the clown. This is not an April Fool's joke. It's right here, guys. Oh my gosh. So we've been finding the Hogan. We still need to find the Andre. Thanks, brother. Not toy related, but definitely nostalgia related uh, at the um, Fizzy Rockets, Rocket Fizz or whatever it was called. Picked up the Superman um tin you know i guess you could say plate that's going to go up or a street sign that's going to go up on the wall somewhere uh the complete story of the daring exploits of one and only superman i like the other ones i like the dc comic one but i think this is the one that i'm going to go with i love this wonder woman sign right here this is an awesome one uh number one the wonder woman number one look at that 10 cents a complete 64 page issue containing all new never before published adventures of wonder woman so there you go. 
oh, this one just stood out because I'm in, we are MCU family and we actually watched this when we were with the family um the um civil war so it kind of just kind of reminded me of it where you got um super soldier you know you got red skull and captain america the ongoing battle between good and evil so even though red skull wasn't i don't think he was in civil war but you know the whole thing with hydra and zemo and all that stuff so definitely uh something that we will put up and enjoy Shout out to all my boys in Long Island. You guys remember every day going to the ball field, stopping by the chocolate pot, getting some Bazooka Joe um, or Wallbaums. You know what I'm saying? Just going to the supermarket. Wallbaums. We need. Do they still have Wallbaums or Pathmarks up up there in a uh, up in Long Island? But uh, Bazooka Joe and his gang. I think I broke many teeth trying to chew this gum. Five cents at the time, and of course I had a little mini comics. This is this was an easy pull. If I was gonna get just one this would have been just the one and one more they said buy four get one and i did pick up the action comics dc comics action comics i said dc comics action comics number one with uh superman uh lifting that lifting that vehicle right there it was buy four get one and i this was the last one that i picked and i think i got a buddy of mine that i'm going to send this to so um i think he'll thoroughly enjoy this one while we were out found some good deals we found mario at four bucks luigi was still at 1250 so i left luigi gonna definitely definitely play 10 or under nine or under so we got mario to go with bowser we still need luigi and that's it um if peach drops down price we'll get her too or toad but we need mario definitely need will definitely need luigi so there you go there's mario and earlier you saw superman and you know his thing is kryptonite well kryptonite with us you, you know it, Super 7 Reaction. They had these. We have most of the run of the Godzilla collection. I can't collect all the big monsters of it, so I'm just going to downsize, get a highly detailed Super 7 Reaction Godzilla figure. Leave it in the comments. I don't care. Collect what you like. We like this. Angry, Angriest, Angriest, whatever his name is, Baragon. I'm bad with names. You guys already know that. And then, of course... Maguera, Magura, Magrera, Magura, Magrera. He looks like a, he almost looks like a, um, Big Bird. <laughs> so we got three more Godzillas. I don't know what else we have to do on that wave. There's still quite a bit, but, um, it's an addiction. And again, I like the detail of them. I like that the miniatures, you know, not miniature, but the three and three quarter type of scale. It looks good on the shelf together when you have all your monsters. So. Um, we don't have enough now in the future, you know, if we get another room where we could, you know, get like Shogun style or really huge, um, you know, Godzilla figures, that would be pretty awesome. But as of right now, this will do. Speaking of Big Bird and Sesame Street, that's right. Sesame Street, The Count. And yip, 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 yip. Go ahead and do it. Uh-huh. Uh-huh. Yip, 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 yip. Uh-huh. Yep, 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 uh-huh. Since we're over here in Super 7 Reaction, it was a buy one, get one at GameStop. So I found a, another JMJ that I'm going to take off card, and I don't have run. Now I have run. Now all I need is a DMC, and um, we should be good. And if you guys didn't know, DMC is a collector, so that'd be pretty awesome to add there. So let's buy one, get one. Yeah. Now, is that worth it, guys? Six ninety seven for two? Absolutely. The last thing at that GameStop that my boy and I found was the Wolverine uh 50th anniversary marvel's patch joe fix it so undercover as his alter ego patch wolverine cons joe fix it into helping him take down the crime lords of madripoor so uh i have ideas with this we're gonna do a little um obi-wan you know obi-wan was it club obi-wan and we're gonna get uh dr jones some other suited bodies together for a couple pictures um i just had to those are a lot of the things that, you know, uh, I found with the family. Let's go ahead and see what, you know, you guys kind of saw. If you watched the first video, which dropped on Monday, April Fool's Day with my granddaughter and wife, Marsha, if you would see the things that they found in that video. And let me tell you, yes, in that video, we did pick up a few things. So hang tight and let's see what we got. Before we get into this really special haul from my two beautiful ladies, Let's go ahead and say a beautiful man, Seth. 
for finding Ken Masters for me. Um, if you watched his uh, live, he did a live. I wanted to do a live, but this week's going to be tough for, for this video. So I'm going to at least try to premiere it. So we're premiering hopefully by now. But Seth on his live, he did, you know, talk about uh, the two, the, the things that he found. Ken Masters, he had to travel out of state to find it. And he found an extra one for me. And we were, at ju we were just talking about it either the day before or the night before. So here's Ken Masters. Um, thanks Seth. And then of course it was a trade, you know, I, I gave him something that I knew he would want. And then of course, uh, he knew I wanted this. So that's how, that's what buddies do, right? Trade one for one staying with the street fighter theme. That's right. They found M Bison and Dalsum. My goodness. I couldn't believe it when Marsha sent me the picture and she sent me that little video actually. Well, the picture in the video of, uh, some other things, which we'll talk about here in a second, but Dawson, we are going full full tilt on Street Fighter 2 um, from Jada just because the price point, the way they feel, the way they move, um, the accessories you get. I mean, even if I was going to do an inbox, you know, I still have my inbox for my Ryu, Chun-Li, and Fei Long. But, you know, if you just put them back into the arcade and just put them up on a shelf somewhere, it's just they're doing it good. And you saw in the video, not not from this video, the previous video. Let me go ahead and uh, make sure I get that clear. They found it in the part one of the spring break vlog so this was their find along with the street fighter so they found the um, target exclusive star wars retro collection and her favorite is queen amidala we got a smart one in front of us guys in the granddaughter she's going to be a superstar one day she really is and oh you know what let's do this real quick since i have your attention and if i don't have your attention that means that you're not you're watching something else here we go jar jar wow look at that nice who's this darth maul wow i almost want to get another one to keep him on card but you know obi-wan young mcgregor right there young obi-wan qui-gon jinn very awesome to find and see there is a battle droid I might get another pack just so I can get another Queen Amidala and send it to my granddaughter. I think she would get a kick out of that. A few more. Uh, yeah, so that was all uh, my wife and granddaughter, but they actually found more. Again, going back to the part one video that dropped uh, Monday night, there is Metalhead, Cobra Metalhead. That's right, Duke. Retro card of Duke. Classic Duke. Love it. Retro Scarlet, finally. Head sculpts, not too bad. A definitely total package. Definitely like this one a lot better than the um, first wave, first or second wave of the G.I. Joe Classified Scarlets. So, awesome. And here we got Rakondo. Definitely going to be replacing my other Rakondo, which I think was Tiger Force Rakondo. I'll probably keep his head sculpt, put him on a suited body for, I don't know, Somewhere in a cantina, like a, an assistant manager, or something like that, dishwasher. But this Rakondo right here, dope. I'm digging it. Oh, the cards. Cards. Two more pickups from my wonderful granddaughter, Scarlet Spider. Definitely a great pickup right here. And her favorite, she said it three times on the video. <laughs> tombstone that was not scripted she just kept going with the word tombstone three times so there he is i'll let it play real quick tombstone. Tombstone. Yeah, she got tombstone. geeked up about this guy i think she just liked the you know that monster look to him so she she said he um reminded her of the hulk and yes she knows who the hulk is so there you go i think what we have next is we're actually going to dip into a little bit more of that toyland stuff if you've heard me talk about toyland before probably once or a million times i'm going to keep on saying it toyland toyland so let's see what we got there if you go back to preview night you could see that animal warriors of the kingdom we we kind of circled back and forth back and forth too and they gave us even a little hammer saying hey don't forget us we got some pretty cool stuff spiro toys and awok so i was like all right cool and again guys they're great uh we met jason and we met nick and hung out with nick for a little bit great dudes and of course the other guys i forgot their names but man they were just really really cool they kind of captured us we kept looking back and they're great figures we knew they were but we finally picked up something um during toilet i think it was one of our first pickups you guys know we like the beefy figures, so we went with the general. Had to. Love the color scheme. 
we love really that that head sculpt in there so we got the general this is our first and we're not going to do a series run as of right now but definitely something to add to our shelf i think um the anamorphic type creatures i'm really really digging that i know we got some on the way from other um other toy lines and i think they would just kind of look good together on the shelf so we went with the general you need a general in this household he's it well we got a beast man over here now we have the general what else can we get i'm not the only one that has a kryptonite to super seven reaction you guys saw marcia finding the gem figures um yeah she's been eyeballing them when she saw them online so uh, leave it in the comments if you or your friend or anybody who collects gem or loves gem like the cartoon and stuff like that I know Marsha did so uh, we got gem and pizzazz and I'm pretty sure there's like 8 million different variations of the gem Bucky O'Hare I didn't collect Bucky O'Hare as a kid and I'm pretty sure this is the re-release of the Bucky O'Hare figures well this one says here 2017 so um we found a lot of these at Ollie's, and it's okay. We, we missed out on this one, but the guy gave us a pretty good deal. So this was the only other one that we really needed to add to the Bucky O'Hare type of little mini mini scene. You know what I mean? Shout out to our buddy JT, Sasquatch Toys. They said they brought some Mars attacks, and I'm already regretting not getting the other Flying Saucer. Now, I mean, I'm glad I got this one, because I've never seen this one. I've seen the other one a couple places, but I should have just got them both at the same time. So, JT, Sasquatch Toys, uh, I'm not, you know, not now, but in the future, if you still have it, I'll definitely grab it off of you. But, um, Mars attacks, the Doom Saucer, to add to our Mars attacks collection. One more big shout out to Big Dub. Um who had the panel with the four horsemen and it was really really um you know insightful it was great seeing the guys and again true collectors artists bringing them together great line mythic and cosmic legions we looped it once and we kept looping it back and we just had to pick up a few things and let me show you what we got a lot of the cosmics do stick out and i have to kind of still stay in my lane but i couldn't pass on this guy right here and again i can't re really pronounce his name but i'm gonna say Svexian prison guard Svexian so his wingspan is ginormous I don't know how or where I'm going to display him because I want him I want him like you know wings spread out fully displayed so it's going to be interesting and a um, challenge but it's a challenge well worth accepting cosmic legions this is our one and we got one from mythics and here it is Kalazir, I think that's that's who it is, right? I'm pretty sure <laughs> that's who it is. Kalazir, there's his little bio and description right there. But anyways, Kalazir was out of his box and in display and cast a spell on me a couple times until I picked him up. So Kalazir um, is going to look good really anywhere you put him. The detail, the way they had him posed, uh, tremendous. So we had to pick him up. Um, we already had the blue dragon, thanks to uh, Tracy over at Needless Toys and Collectibles. And of course, we got was it the slog, the big green frog guy with the spacesuit. So, ag again, just going for big. Um, they're they're all big and imposing looks. Every single character from Mythic and Cosmic Legions, but you cannot deny this guy right here. The detail, the look. Oh yeah, and don't forget the lamp. You got a lamp. Make a wish. Yeah, Epic Hall, definitely an Epic Hall way to, you know, to start, you know, uh, the, I guess the con season with Toylanta and then, of course, visiting family out there at the Targets and Walmarts. And, of course, my granddaughter always pulling through with the clutch. Just her luck, her and Marsha together. That's the dream team, guys. I'm telling you. Um, th again, they've said it before. Uh, Marsha should start her own channel. And I guess her sidekick would be uh, K-Bop, you know, our, our, our granddaughter. That would be so amazing and cute and funny at all. So hopefully the cuteness overload didn't get to you guys. But if it did, you know, what are you going to do about it, right? Two things. Nothing. And you're going to like it. And just joking around, guys. Thank you again for all all your support with that being said i do have a couple of you guys that i am sending some stuff to and i got two more hauls actually one's one that's it kind of they're just i got it to see what happens and then of course uh, my favorite haul which is uh here in a second so this i got from um i got some stickers that's right we went stickers <laughs> there they are little jb's toy trunk um decals not bad not bad at all and uh i'm gonna be sending this out to um a lot of people and uh, just as a thank you and um 
you know, and then some of you guys I do owe a few things to as far as, and that's what I was holding off on shipment to, to get these in. They actually came in that Friday that we left for Toy Atlanta. But uh, you guys know the logo. That's my logo. That's been the logo uh, since we really started kicking off. So um, look at that. <laughs> Not bad. Not bad. <laughs> So that's one haul that I really enjoyed. And then the other one was you guys saw in the video with um, my granddaughter. She, uh, not luckily, she, she worked her magic. She's a sorceress. Not the toy sorceress from Toy Habits. She's, she's, she's good too, but uh, K-Bop, she, she found a winner when it came to the uh the little tokens at that one anime store so we got a little tv screen arcade screen with zangief and dawson which you guys saw her and Marsha found me the dawson so i mean what else, what else could he ask for right awesome times here on the channel awesome times really in life um like we always say at the end of every video always enjoy the ride in life we'll see you guys next time peace oh yeah holy moly god that's <laughs> dramatic